Welcome to a new video on my driving robot discovery which is based on the TXT controller from Visitechnic running embedded Linux powered by Visitechnic Equipack and equipped with a motor with propeller to show that the algorithm is still running an LED that shows when something is about to happen or happening like different distance towards uh, objects which are detected by either two front sensors or and or sonar active sonar on front uh, programmed in online mode using Python the objective is to run in a straight line towards the objects and if the camera had been active it could have uh, singled out red color but um, this conversion doesn't uh, work with the camera so I took it off for a while last time I um, found that depending on the hind wheel um, it runs uh, anywhere but a straight line which should not be possible because the motors are programmed to run in a straight line. So, with the wheels, uh, the hind wheels right now uh, in a straight line, it should run that way. First of all, uh, let's go to the software and see if everything works, and then see if uh, it does run in a straight line. Next, um, Blender modeling or modeling using Blender 3D um, and see if I can get the model better than last time since I found out that copying the wrong uh, elements makes coloring a little bit problematic. Anyway, writing first. Alright, everything powered up. So let's um, see if some things work. Well, the distance of about 20, uh, 72 centimeters, uh, but the battery charge is not that much. So let's also test other stuff like the front sensor that works, and this one works as well. It hangs a little bit again. So that is alright. Does it run? Um, slow speed. Slow speed. Uh, too slow speed. So yeah, that works. And that one works as well. That's good. It doesn't run too fast. So I think I have to be careful with that and um, let's go in here this is for the code oh yeah right let's uh, do the date as well and time which is 18 and 19, 30, 19 hours, 38 minutes. That's better. All right, and here I run the code. Go that should lead it straight to the objects. Well, not entirely straight. And it doesn't even make it to the whole object. So I'm going to do that again. Um, Alright. Uh, 
Sono 45 68 okay a little bit closer 62 and this is 60 that's all right no here um hand wheel in a straight line let's run it hopefully this time for the better But does it touch it? And that is the result I want to see. Nothing more, nothing less. Absolutely the result. So data going to the end battery pack is all right um, going towards the end but this is absolutely it 350 that's good call the 11 that's also good so yeah i'm happy with this result what i could do as well is what i did um what i've done with the um, walking robot setting the distance but that will be uh soon for now time to uh do something with uh blender again all right a blender it is and this uh, used to be a big thing but then I found out that um, when you copy the blocks they take the same uh, they take the same core now if I go back to camera view um i see that this one is black and this is all black except for the motors are red here's some red and here as well so when it comes to this block am i able to change the color independently yeah, I can. Oh. Yeah, I can too. But why is this reddish? Okay. So now I need to copy this one. Okay, duplicate right here is that right there indeed looks like it it's 3d so it may be a bit more complicated okay how many blocks are there once again there are uh, one oh there's a short block by the way short short long short okay so I'm doing it wrong short short long short this means that I have to remove um, short short long so this one I have to move over here. Copy this one. Yeah. And copy this one. 
then short short long short um, that is a long one but turned so this one duplicate yes and then rotate over here this one yeah that's about right next is a long one so I better copy this one I put it here although these are all reddish and I don't like that yeah that is one why is this red this is a different color altogether and since they are coupled yeah this is not correct at all so let's do it like that and make them red or black so these are coupled and these are coupled that's okay next is short and long and the short one is by the looks of it so I'll have to look here short one is red so I, don't, I should not copy instead this is a short one and I have to add it add mesh cube and then yeah that's the whole problem how big um, scaling is the answer that's the one and still not correct still not correct Anyway, this is red. So, no, I have to. Yeah, diffuse. This is a red one. but not quite a cube now it is about a cube so yeah I'll take it for now and then it will be a long one so taking this one duplicate right here and this 
is about right. This is how it should be. So, the little ones are copies, the long ones are copies, and then there's a separate copy. And that's from I think. And that's it for now. Um, some uh, nice tracks. Well, ending with a nice one at least. Um, and made some improvements uh, with uh, Blender. For now, uh, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and give the video a thumbs up. Leave a comment or suggestion. Always um, appreciated. You can also follow me via Instagram and Twitter. Um, Please show your support by making a donation via either PayPal or Wired. And uh, you can also become a patron and depending on the pledge you make, uh, have your name mentioned on the website and within videos. For more information, please see under this video. Um, to be continued, have a nice day and bye bye.